Hello everybody and welcome to Adam vs. The Man. Today we have the original coronavirus guidelines from Dave Barry and Iowa Hawk, at least allegedly. So let's get right into it. This I found from Sam Rob on Facebook. Copied and pasted from a friend, original source unknown, but suspected to be the illegitimate love child of Dave Barry and Iowa Hawk. I truly love and, and connect with Dave Barry's sense of humor, and I would not be surprised at all if he wrote this. It's extremely libertarian in attitude. I really love this. Here are the official coronavirus guidelines. One, basically, you can't leave the house for any reason, but if you have to, then you can. Two, masks are useless, but maybe you have to wear one. It can save you, it is useless, but maybe it is mandatory as well. Three, stores are closed, except those that are open. Four, you should not go to hospitals unless you have to go there. <laughs> Same applies to doctors. You should only go there in case of emergency, provided you are not too sick. <laughs> I can't even get through this. Five, this virus is deadly but still not too scary, except that sometimes it actually leads to a global disaster. Six, gloves won't help, but they can still help. Seven, everyone needs to stay home, and that's in all caps, but it's important to go out. <laughs> there is no shortage of groceries in the supermarket, but there are many things missing when you go there in the evening, but not in the morning. Sometimes. The virus has no effect on children, except those it affects. Ten, animals are not affected, but there is still a cat that tested positive in Belgium in February when no one had been tested, plus a few tigers here and there. Eleven, you will have many symptoms when you are sick, but you can also get sick without symptoms, have symptoms without being sick, or be contagious without having symptoms. Oh my. Twelve, in order not to get sick, you have to eat well and exercise, but eat what you, whatever you have on hand, and it's better not to go out. Well, but no. <laughs> Thirteen, it's better to get some fresh air, but you get looked at very wrong when you get some fresh air. And most importantly, you don't go to parks or walk. But don't sit down, except that you can do that now if you are old, but not for too long, or if you are pregnant, but not too old. <laughs> 14. You can't go to retirement homes, but you have to take care of the elderly and bring them food and medication. 15. If you are sick, you can't go out, but you can go to the pharmacy. 16. You can get restaurant food delivered to the house, which may have been prepared by people who didn't wear masks or gloves, but you have to have your groceries decontaminated outside for 13 hours. Pizza too. 17. Every disturbing article or news interview starts with I don't want to trigger panic, but <laughs> 18, you can't see your older mother or grandmother, but you can take a taxi and meet an older taxi driver. 19, you can walk around with a friend, but not with your family if they don't live under the same roof. 20, you are safe if you maintain the appropriate social distance, but you can't go out with friends or strangers at the safe social distance. 21, the virus remains active on different surfaces for two hours. No, four, no, six, no, we, we didn't say hours, maybe days, but it takes a damp environment. Oh no, not necessarily. 22. The virus stays in the air. Well, no. Or yes. Maybe. Especially in a closed room. Or in or in one hour, a sick person can infect 10. So if it falls, all our children were already infected at school before it was closed. But remember, if you stay at the recommended social distance, however, in certain circumstances, you should maintain a greater distance, which studies show the virus can travel further. Maybe. 23. We count the number of deaths, but we don't know how many people are infected as we have only tested so far those who are almost dead to find out if that's what they will die of. 24. We have no treatment except that there may be one that apparently is not dangerous unless you take too much, which is the case with all medications. 25. We should stay locked up until the virus disappears, but it will only disappear if we achieve collective immunity. So when it circulates... 
but we must no longer be locked up for that. Yes, thank you so much, Dave Barry and Iowa Hawk, allegedly, or whoever it was who was behind that who put together. This thing is going super viral on Facebook. You can share it from my page. You want to share it from my page, give me credit. This is where you got it from. Great. This is, this is a great laugh in a great way it, with, with a very libertarian, questioning authority spirit, spirit of having a laugh at coronaphobia. So.